Hey friends, I'm early today because I just couldn't wait. We have so many new pieces and um, I've got some new pieces that are part of our regular price collection. And then I've got some Wabi Sabi pieces that uh, we just added and they're spectacular. Um, so I thought I'd get a, an early start. It is a full rack of amazing things. So hi, Margo, thanks for joining. So the first one that I'm gonna show you are some new pieces that we just added to our regular price collection. Thank you so much for joining. And I put one of them on. I'm gonna have to tilt this now. So this is a cardigan um, and it's just black with embroidered, like kind of like, it's almost like a taupe or a pewter maybe. So it's got some pewter thread work through here. This here is more embroidery and it looks a little bit more pewtery because um, there's just more thread going through it. But to get a black piece that's just, you know, a basic throw over top of anything, um, cardigan piece is so rare. And then for it just to have this little bit of interest, I thought I had to show it to you first um, because I'm in love with it. And the other thing that I've just recently fallen in love with are these earrings. Can you guys see them? Hold on. So we carry these in store. These ones are by Suzy Blue. Um, so they're ethically made in Bali. And look at, let me take it off, I'll show you. Um, the beadwork is so delicate. Let me see, if, yeah, there, you can see it there. So <laughs> I couldn't wait either. Oh, that's so sweet. So yeah, check these out. We have them in this shade. We don't only have three pairs of each or maybe four pairs. Um, but have a look at that incredible, delicate embroidery. And these are twin or beadwork. These are 24 dollars. So um, I think if you type in beadwork, you'll find them. But I just uh, spent some time wandering around the store and I'm like, how do I not own these yet? So now I do. Um, and I got them in the red too. So uh, first I'm going to show you a bunch of pieces that are part of our regular price collection that we just released today. There we go. So the first one is this one. Um, you'll find it under cardigans, and I'm going to put on my glasses so that I can read. What I'll do is I'll read out the PRG codes to you guys because I find that that's easier for everybody to find things. So this one is PRC2446, and it has been released. It's live on the website, and we never get just a plain black cardigan. So I expect that this will go very quickly. Um, it says that it's a crepe silk because it's not really sheer, but I want to say it's not really not sheer either. So for some of you who are like, you know what, I really don't, I'm not a fan of the crepe silk because it feels a little thicker. You don't need to worry about that with this. So that is the first piece that I'm showing you. So again, that's part of the full price collection, but I'm going to be showing you some pieces that are part of the, I'm going to just pick my favorites. Out. I'm going to pick my favorites. So check this one out. This was just released to the full price collection too. Have a look at that amazing print. I, I don't know. Yeah, I think you guys are seeing it as vividly as it is. It's so freaking beautiful. And I think that there's a Wabi Sabi kimono sleeve top uh, or poncho that's coming out in the same, poncho that's coming out in the same fabric today. It's already been released. So I think last time I spent um, some time showing you how the, uh, these are called midi length caftans look on. And then when we did that try on on Wednesday with Jacqueline, she tried a sheer one on and it looked amazing on her. She wore it with heels. So that's what this one looks like. It's got some little embroidery, like some gold embellishment just there on the sleeve. Uh, looks like it needs a bit of ironing flat there. Um, but yeah, it's a beautiful, beautiful sheer fabric. I love that it has the gray in it and the black and the white, which means you can pretty much pair it with anything, but then you've got that pop of color. And like with the other uh, caftan styles, it's really easy to just go in from underneath, grab a little section, and then tie like an elastic or something there. And what that does is it gives you a bit of a gather right there, which allows you to add a bit of definition if you'd like, but you don't have to. And this would make a great bathing suit cover up as well. So this piece here is part of our full price collection. It was just released today. And it is PRG as in George. 2475 and you should be able to find it that way um i will fly i'm going to show you all of them but i'm going to go quickly through some of them so this one is a tapered tunic great colors uh this one is prg 1048 
Um, this next one, I think we've seen some pieces in this fabric already, and I was telling you how much I liked that kind of bullseye look that it has there in the front or the back, uh, depending on how you wear it. And this one is kind of greens, like a, an army green and blue, an uh, indigo blue, and then a pale blue. And this one here is PRG2176. That little fun circle-y friend there. It's cute. So again, full price collection. Um, this one here, some beautiful soft colors if you know somebody who's going away. Um, just a really soft, uh, I want to say it's a slightly more pastel uh, Tiffany blue. And then it's got a little bit of lavender and then some coral. So this one is also beautiful. This one is not sheer. And it is PRC22224. Thank you everybody for joining and giving up your Friday nights again. It's nice to see you though. Okay, here's another one, full price collection. So much fun. Okay, this one I'm gonna try on because I'm gonna be showing you a lot of ponchos today. So I just wanna spend some time showing you the different ways you can wear them. So when you look at this one this way, you can have all flowers at the front or you can have all polka dots at the front or you can wear it asymmetrically and kind of mix it up a bit. So if you wear it asymmetrically, you can wear it this way. Hi, Catherine. Who else have I missed there? I don't know. I can't, I can't see. Um, so yeah, so this one, you can have the flowers coming down that way. You can wear it this way where it's more like a, um, a tunic. It's, it's more like a tunic top um, and you can tie those edges together, which helps it stay in place as well. Or you can wear it this way or with the polka dots to the front and it looks more like a kimono sleeve top and I was wearing one last time when on Wednesday when I saw you guys and I realized that I hadn't tied the ends together and so while I was wearing it it was spinning around so lesson learned maybe tie something maybe maybe tie the ends together and that way it will always sit like that and you don't have to worry about it spinning so this one here again was just released today and it is PRG 2467 Okay, the next one I'm gonna show you is one of my very, very favorite colors. Um, I think I'm gonna be showing you, no, this is the only piece in this. So check this one out. Look at that rich, rich purple. It's freaking gorgeous. Um, so this one is a midi length caftan, it's sheer. Uh, the front and back are very similar. It's kind of an abstracty design, but it's really just the two colors. And the PRG code, on this one is PRG 2510 uh, but it's really beautiful just gorgeous um, that I think the colors coming out really true for you it's kind of like a deeper periwinkle hey Cynthia thanks for joining um, okay next one Whoops. this one's really pretty too so this is another uh, midi length caftan and what I like about it is it's got this taupe background. Yeah, the purple was lovely, Sheena. As soon as I was looking, I'm like, that's a Sheena color. Um, can I get the color to be accurate for you? So it is, but it's like, I think it probably looks closest when I back up. So the background is a taupe. And then on top of the taupe, you have peach and coral. So it's various tones of taupe with various tones of peach and coral. And as soon as I get close up to the camera, it blues out, which is no fun at all. I wonder if I have control over that. Hold on a second, guys. Oh, yep, yeah, there we go. So now you can see the color a little more accurately. It's still bluing out a bit, um, but it's, it's pretty close. So this one is gorgeous. It's very, very delicate, but that color here, what, whatever, like it's like a persimmon down here is stunning. Um, so this one is PRG2455. Again, these are part of our full price collection. This one here has so much freaking embroidery on it. I don't know. It's a crepe silk um, and really soft. And now can I show you the embroidery? So you can see it's right, yeah, I think you can see it there. You can see the embroidery there. So it's got that light embroidery all the way through the back. Um, and then on the front, it's got a little more embroidery down here at the bottom. 
So it's still just kind of like lines of embroidery, but there's a lot more pattern going down there. Um, beautiful colors, very, very soft. Um, I think the color, it's like a sky blue, a marigold, and green, leaf green. And then like the ombres of it in between. But really incredible fabric. This one is PRC2561. Oh, this one's sweet. So this is just a small print in red, very, very tiny little bouquets of flower. This one is PRC2566. It is a crepe silk, but it is not a super thick crepe silk. It's not really sheer, but it's also not, um, it's not like heavy or dense at all. Hi, Debbie. Um, okay, this one here, oh, cute, right? I'm, I'm seeing we're getting more of these where you get like a solid pattern through here and then the pattern, like the solid piece through here, which kind of triangulates you here. And then you get these other patches of color and then the back is all red. Oh, it's gorgeous. Can you guys see the tone on tone flowers on that? That's so beautiful. That's really rich. Um, this one is a uh, Georgette silk and it's PRG 2481. And um, again, these are the full price pieces. This one is 155. The midi length caftans are 155. When we get into the Wabi Sabi collection really soon, um, those ones are the ones that are 40% off. This one's a really luscious silk as well. So soft, a lot of earth tones going on here. And um, beautiful, I wanna say like they have, it's fall tones. It's like fall tones from the 80s. It's blooming out again for you guys. Um, I feel like if I sneak up to the camera, maybe I can get it to not blue out, but it does blue for you. It's, it's warmer looking in person than it looks on screen. Okay, this next one, guys, people are gonna be fighting over it. I already know. I'm gonna tell you the number first. Um, okay, the number is PRC2541. It's a crepe silk. That's it. It's just ultramarine blue, and um, it's got little embellishments on it. That's actually thread work, little tiny knots in silver thread. And then in the front, you have this thread work here. It is really something, really, really spectacular. Not something that you need to wear anything underneath. Um, in terms of the itchiness factor, I wanna say you can feel the threads, um, but I wouldn't say that they're itchy. You can just kind of feel them. If you have really sensitive skin, this type of embroidery may bother you. If you don't, you're, you're good, but it's gorgeous to look at. It must have been an incredible sorry you guys there you can see it there really luscious color um, and I've already told you the code on that one this one here oh that's sweet this is a waterfall top and um, I don't know how many full price ones I think I have a few full price ones here but then I'm going to be releasing a bunch of them of the Wabi Sabi ones next Friday so next Friday's live is going to be caftans and waterfall tops so that's what this one looks like it's really fun and that's what it looks like at the back and of course you can wear either side to the front I like to take this one and tuck it in a little bit like that and then leave the back long um, so things are covered but you know you can wear it any way you want and the name of this one is it has a big fancy name but the PRC coat it's gray lag goose um, but it's PRG 2382 if you're looking for it so I think there's a couple of waterfall tops here in a row. So I'm gonna show those to you. And, ooh, they're so cute. So I'm gonna grab them all at once so I can show you the colors because I really wanna to get to the pieces that are on sale that I just released because they are bananas. Okay, for my, my fans of fuchsia and magenta, this one is extraordinary. I think you can see the colors really true there. Hi, Ellen. So there you can see there, ah, now you can see it there. So it's absolutely gorgeous. Um, it's a digital print, so there's no embroidery on it. It looks like it's embroidered, but it's not. Those are all printed on. And it is pretty much the same front and back. Um, so these tops fit from a size two to a size three X, and there's lots of room through the hip and you can reach your pockets uh, because it's got side slits. So these ones go for 115 and this is PRG 2354. 
Here's another pink one. Now this one, that last one was a Georgette silk. This one is a crepe silk, but look at that fun pattern. And this one is just, this one screams, I'm going on vacation, sucks to be you. My husband came home today saying that a friend of ours is going to Hawaii. And then he was just sad all afternoon. <laughs> yeah, that one was really something, right, Sheena? I know those are great colors for you. But this one, I really love the corally kind of color there. The, it is a coral, it's a deep coral. Um, next to the pinks and the reds. Beautiful. And then it's got this one little stripe of gold right there, which is kind of fun. Um, and the name of this one is, well, it's P, it's actually called Boc Macchieri, but it's PRC 2427. Oh, here's another one. Beautiful shades of blue in that. So it's a sky blue, and then it's got multicolored kind of... <laughs> I want to say 1990s colors right in there. Some really vivid pinks and yellows and blues. Uh, this line down the center is closer to a, I want to say it's a persimmon as well. Like it's a deep, deep coral. The silk on this is spectacular. Um, love that stripe down the front. So this one here is PRC2416. And then here's two more. Oh, these are adorable. So this one's for all my earth tony people. This is gorgeous. I love this pattern down the center and then how it kind of angles out that way, even though that's a seam, right? So those were designed that way. And on the back, it's totally different because you have two totally different parts of the sari put together. And that one is, oh, dropped one. Um, okay, so this one here is PRG2352. And then this one that I dropped is some really sweet colors. It's um, very soft and, uh, and muted. It's, it's a taupey gray. I wanna say it's like Revere Pewter if you're somebody who knows your Benjamin Moore paints because it's somewhere between a beige and a gray. It's a grayish. And then on this side, you have white with a raspberry and then some indigo blue, some uh, um, a crew in there. Uh, but I love those colors together, the gray and the acru with accented. Oh, look at that. That's really beautiful. Very boho. So this one again is a full price piece. So it's 115 and it's PRG 2403. Okay, the next pieces I'm gonna show you are ponchos. So these are full price ponchos. Again, they were just released today. Look at that purple. So this one is a lot softer. It's more of a lilac. The other one was more of a, a violet, I guess, and this one is softer, but it's with grays and creamy whites. And is the color true? I think it's coming out pretty true for you guys. The silk on this one is spectacularly soft and it's PRC 2462. Now these are both ponchos as well. Oh, this one's kind of fun. Okay, I don't know if you can see that pattern. It's bluing out again. That's probably closer. Um, but as soon as I go back, you can see the richness of the color, which I think as soon as I get close, you lose that. The silk is really, really soft. It's um, kind of like a mid-tone marine blue and red and cream and gray. But I think what makes it really pop is that it has marigold in there. If you can see that there. Really soft, soft fabric. And then it's got this great little border on the front as well. So again, this was just released to our full price collection. This is PRC 2552. Oh, another great silk. I feel like I showed you the silk last week in something else. Because I was talking about how it's kind of got this zebra print down here, but then these oversized boho flowers. This is another really boho piece, but I love how it has the black in it because it lets you pair it with pretty much anything. Um, and then that's gray, not blue. Just so you know, right there. And this one is PRC2553. Okay, the next couple of pieces are, ooh, cute, are really cute. Okay, I don't know if we have, let me see if I can show you some of these in some semblance of an order. Ooh, oh, wait till I show you guys that one. Um, oh my God, and that one. All right, I think I'm just gonna go by color because holy cow. Um, all right, so I showed you 
I'm gonna show you some blues next. Um, Cause I know everybody likes a good blue. So there's this one. And then after the blues, I'm gonna show you the purples cause there's some bananas purples. Okay, so this is kind of it for the blues that just got added. So for this one, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got little black sparkles right through there that are done in little rhinestones. And the rest of it is gray and then different shades of sky blue, um, not teal, it's definitely blue. And this one is a side tie top, so you could get so much wear out of this. Like this one is just easy peasy to match with your wardrobe. This one is PRC2066 and it's a side tie top. This next one here, also in blues, is a waterfall top. Kind of like a batik style print um, or a resist print. Actually, it looks like it's resist printed. So the, what that means, and just so you know, the colors are kind of like a grayish and then indigo blue. Are the side tie tops longer than the box tops? Yes, let me show you. So the way, thank you for asking. So um, people always uh, ask me this. So I'm gonna try to show you lengthwise how it works. So that's that. That's that. And that. Okay, so here are the tops from shortest to longest. Okay. So this is the boxy. Oh no, I made a mistake. Okay, hold on, I'm getting there. Okay. So this is the shortest top. It's the boxy top. Um, it works really well with high-waisted pants. It's really very loose around here, but it's short. So it's probably gonna cut at the belly button, or if you have a bigger bust, it's gonna cut higher. We recommend the boxy top for up to a size 12. So that is the shortest. After the boxy top, the next um, length, and we find people who are more petite enjoy this one. This one is the front tie top. So it's a few inches longer. You can see when I'm wearing it, it comes to, even the tie part comes, I'm gonna say a couple of inches above the crotch, but then the sides go quite long. And if I were to wear it backwards, it covers your hips and your crotch. So that's the second length. That is a front tie top. Then the next length is the side tie top. And the side tie top is about two inches longer than the front tie top. It is the same length all the way around with the exception of the side ties, which add a little bit of length at the side if you don't tie them up, definitely covers the crotch um, and gives you probably an extra two or three inches on top of that length. If I put this here, my crotch is there. So about three inches below crotch. And then this one is the longest of the tops. And this one goes almost to your knees. So that's the order. I think that there is on the website, if you go under tops and tunics, there's a chart there. The first item is a chart that says tops and tunics by length. And I'm not sure if the waterfall top is on there, but all the other ones are on there and it shows you um, which is which. So that was a really good question and thank you for asking me. Now, we'll pick these guys back up. So this one I was gonna tell you is resist printed. And what that means is, yep, we got that. Um, so what they would have done is they would have, looks like the fabric was over dyed because the first dyeing was done with a gray and then it was dyed on top of that with a blue. But in order, they'll, they'll dip it in a dye and then they put color uh, wax or mud on it and then they dip it again and then wherever that mud was, it gets resist, like it resists taking the dye and then they just keep doing that and then they get rid of all of that wax or mud that they used. And you can see where the dye has not been allowed to reach the fabric. So this is resist printed. This one is PRG2392. And then this one here. So we're just doing full price blues right now. Look at that. I hope you guys can see the extraordinary pattern on that. It's beautiful. So it's a mix of teals, blues, and navies and blacks. And then the back is floral with grays and different shades of blue. So on this side, you get more of a darker print. This must've been the fellow of the sari. And then that must have been the body of the sari. And it's extraordinary. It's a midi length caftan. And this one is PRG2515. This next one here is a side tie top. It's crepe. 
uh, so you don't really have to wear anything underneath it. And um, like I was saying, it lands below the crotch. It really is a tunic length. Um, can I see the waterfall top on? Yes, absolutely. So um, this one is a crepe silk, super soft. So this one is PRC983. And let me try that waterfall top on for you. Okay. I do enjoy wearing a waterfall top. I'm gonna pass this for a sec. So with the waterfall tops, you can wear either side to the front. One side has a round neck and one side has a v-neck. So this is what it looks like on. This is the v-neck side. So I'm wearing, it's kind of cold here today and I'm not cold in the store. I'm actually quite warm in the store, but it was so cold that I was like, I'm going to wear lots of layers. So I think maybe I'm, I might be over layered underneath this, but you can see how it sits. So there's a kind of like a seam right here down the middle. And then here on the sides, it opens up. So I would say it comes to about waist, just a little bit above the waist where the slit is, but there's so much fabric that it kind of overlaps anyways. And what that does is it gives you access to your pockets, which is nice. And if you're somebody who's bigger in this area, there's a lot of room for you to fill that out and still have good length on it. Uh, which was why we designed it and then the way we did but if you want if you want to tuck it in you could still do something like that as well because it's such a silk is so soft that you don't never get that bunchy feeling from tucking it in it pretty much just disappears so you could tuck in the front and back or you could just leave it like that and then if i were to flip it around i'll show you guys that too uh for the waterfall top if you flip it around you can wear it with the round neck at the front as well and mostly for the waterfall tops and the tapered tunics, if it hasn't sold already, they come with a matching cardigan if you're somebody who wants to get a set. So that's what that looks like. Yeah. Hope that helps and thank you so much for asking these questions. I love it. It helps me remember that you guys are there because otherwise I kind of feel like I'm just talking to a mirror, which is weird. Um, okay, purples. We're gonna do purples next. Now these are all new purples. And they're really pretty. Oh, wow. Okay, we're gonna call this purple. It is not a purple, but I kind of really need to show it to you. So these are all purplies. Not a purple, that's not a purple. Um, okay, so these are purples. And this one here is a midi length caftan. Sheena, are you drooling? Because you should be. It's pretty special, really, really gorgeous. So this one is sheer, you can see it's got like ultramarine blue, um, periwinkle and then different shades of purple and white and black. It's really something. Um, this one is PR, oh, glasses time. Okay, hold on, hold on. Okay, this one is PRG2466. And I guess it goes here. All right, look at this one. This is another midi length caftan. And I think I just showed you the poncho in this same fabric. It's really soft. This is the midi length caftan in the same fabric. And it's so unbelievably soft. This one is like butter. It's extraordinary. Um, so again, it'll have the same PRG code, it, uh, PRC, PRC. 2462. So that's this one. Um, this one here, it doesn't have purple in it, but I really wanted to show it to you. And it's got gray. That's kind of, you know, not purple. Um, so this whole side is, and look, see, you can see how soft the silk is right there. It's fabulous. Um, it's almost like a speckled, watermarked, I guess, um, gray. But then it ombres into like little bits of bluey little bits of purple you would still call it gray but it's got these ombre undertones through it and then on this side those same ombre colors are more distinct and they're in boxes so you can see them there but then on top of that you have this floral print and in the center of each flower is a tiny little um, iridescent rhinestone and again so freaking soft so this one is a tunic length caftan it's really beautiful, really, really something. 
Um, this one is PRC1856. So there you go. Now, I missed a couple of gray blues, so I'm going to show you those. Gosh, it's hard to show you guys everything. Okay, then I'm going to show you pinks, and then that'll be it, I think. And then I'm going to go on to the, the Wabi Sabi pieces. I'm in love. Yeah, these are phenomenal. Okay, so this one is gray, black, and red. This col These colors always sell so quickly because they match everything in your wardrobe. Oh, and then you're going to love the next one I'm going to show you too. So this one here is PRG, PRG 2355. And I think, for me personally, I would wear it with that red stripe down the front, which would be the round neck. But yeah, such an easy addition to your wardrobe. And, oh, actually, hold on, I'm gonna put a necklace. I tried to get more of these for the store, but Susie Blue is sold out. And I'm not surprised, because it's so cute. Um, like that all funky and fun um so there's that and this one that i'm wearing is pr i'm gonna take it off okay it's pr doo -doo, prg 2355 and um i know you guys are all checked in here so you're already seeing this but if you ever miss one of these I've started adding these lives that I do onto YouTube and then putting them onto um, our website. If you go into the Upcycled Silk Collection, um, it says what's in store and all of the videos that I do here are there so that you can see them. This one here is, so this is a poncho. Nope, it's a kimono sleeve top. But have a look at those colors. It's just gorgeous. It's so like, um, it's like art. It's beautiful. It looks like a really delicate, well-made watercolor. And it's in all of those watery tones, grays, pinks, blues, greens. Just exquisite. Love it. Um, if you're a summer color, this would be great on you. Now this is PRG 2464. And so this is full price, so it's $95. It makes a great gift, because it's just, it's under that $100 mark. And here's another one. This one is, also a kimono sleeve top, and I think I'm gonna be showing you the poncho in this, which is part of the Wabi Sabi collection. So you can see the colors. Again, it looks like a piece of art. It looks looks like a really great watercolor painting, but it's actually, it would be some sort of an etching because you can see the little lines there. Um, really very, very pretty, very neutral. Um, yeah, I think you could wear that with anything. Uh, PRC 2528. And then this one here is kind of fun because it's got this bluey gray, um, but then it's, oh, can I, can I do that green, Sheena? Hmm, can you do that green? Yes, I would say you can do this green because it's all very grayed. There's no yellow in here, it's like a minty green. So yes, I think it would look really nice on you. Um, so this one is kind of fun because it's got the orange with the gray, but then it's softened with blue and red, so. You can see it's like it's, it's really funky just a fun little color mix and this one is a side tie top tunic um so this one here is prg 2064 all right so i'm gonna show you the pinks and then i'll just show you the rest and then we can move on to the sale stuff it is so hard to know what to show you because i kind of love them all okay so these are pinks and then I'm going to say the rest that I've left behind are earth tones. And I'm going to show you this one in the pinks because it's not really pink, but it's really cool. So this one is a digital print. It's a side tie top. Um, you can wear either side to the front. What I love is it's got these grays, whites, and blacks in it, but it also has these jewels. Can you see them there? It's like oversized digital prints of jewels going through here. So rubies and emeralds and diamonds going through there and then across the front as well. So they're just oversized, they're fun, kind of whimsical looking. Um, it's adorable. 
I snuck that in with the pinks. So this one is more of a, I don't even know what you'd call that color. Okay, friends, what color is that? It's not dusty rose. It's not maroon. It's kind of a blush, but it's darker than blush. That's the color right there. I don't know. I don't know what you call it. It's really warm though. It's a warm color and it's a great silk. So this one again is a, um, it's a crepe silk, so it's not see-through. Really, really soft. I don't know, it's like different shades of earth tony brown, but it's got red undertones as well. So it's like brown with red undertones. There's gotta be a name for that color. It's not rust. It's not brick red. I don't know. Okay, so that's that one. And then look at this fun one. This is a waterfall top again. Super bright, great colors. And again, this one fits from a size two to a size three X. And it is PRC 2439. This one is a, ooh, that's nice. So this one is a sheer midi length caftan in grays, blues, whites, greens, and reds. But everything is so soft that you don't feel like, it, it doesn't have a festive feel. It has kind of like a, a muted feel to it. It's very pretty. The, the green kind of disappears. You really just see the blue and the white. And then here's another waterfall top. This one's really sweet too. So it's different shades of pink and then it's got a coral in it. So pink and a coral. And there's the waterfall top. Oh, okay, this one, I'm gonna show you this one which is just great. It's a side tie top, great shades of pink, would be perfect on a vacation. Um, this next one though, this is a kimono sleeve top and it's gorgeous. Like it's really something. I just released this one just before we went live and um, it's pretty spectacular. So yeah, I thought so. It has embroidery. So right there, you can see all of that is embroidered. All of that is embroidered. That's embroidered there, that's embroidered there. It's got a little sun kind of thing happening there. Now, with these tops, you can wear either side to the front. And they look like that on. There. So it's super cute. Just really easy, really fun piece. Um, but that embroidery is insane. Uh, PRC 2252. And then there's only five more that are regular price. And I know, I feel bad showing you every single one, but then everybody's like, no, no, show us, show us. So I'm gonna just fly through these, but then I'm gonna get to the sale pieces that I just released today. So this one is a waterfall top, beautiful, incredibly soft silk on that one. It's a crepe silk. Another waterfall top here, beautiful shades of green and gray. This one is a, mono sleeve top, blacks and corals. I think you can see it better there. Maybe if I go close. Yeah, I think so. That, that's pretty, pretty close. So the silk on this one doesn't have a sheen. It's more like a wash silk. It's really soft and it's crepe. And here's the last two. This one's really sweet. There, the colors are insane. And the silk on this one, again, it's butter. Let me see if I can show you how soft it is. I'm having trouble showing you because of the two layers of silk. Because this one's a little there, you can see it there. It, and you can hear it. Hear that? It's a really nice silk. Um, and then this one, just kind of grays and greeny tones. Celery, I guess, celery and gray. And that's it, we are on to the sale pieces. You guys have been so patient. Um, I'm gonna start with the ponchos because the ponchos are bananas. Like I thought we had great ponchos last time and then we got this set in. Um, if you wanna see the pieces that I'm about to show you really quickly before everybody else um, and you're on the computer, if you go to our website and in the search bar, you type in DEC10 as in December 10, DEC10, all that's gonna pop up are the pieces that I'm about to show you. So you can kind of fly through that list and if there's one 
uh, that you love. Hopefully, when you see it for real, you can you know have you can be, have expected it. Um, the first ones I think that are going to show up are going to be the vests, and then you have to go to the page two to get to the ponchos. But they're really nice, and these ones are the wabi sabi ones, so they're forty percent off. Here we go, everybody. They're really something. Oh, you're going to recognize some of these fabrics, actually. Let me see. Let's start with the ones that you're going to recognize. This one. That one. This one. Okay. So these are fabrics here where I've shown you something else in this fabric today. And so these are the same, the ones I showed you earlier are part of the full price collection, but these ones are part of the Wabi Sabi collection. So we're going to start with that. Okay. So these pieces here are Wabi Sabi pieces. They're all ponchos. And all of these fabrics are fabrics I just showed you earlier on. Um, look at this one. This one wants me so badly. It just keeps, it keeps talking to me and I keep saying, no, I have enough. Um, but look at that. It's bananas how nice this one is. And then it's got that great gold border there at the bottom. It's insane. Love this one. Um, and it's a poncho, so it's easy to wear, fits everybody, would make a great gift, but it is Wabi Sabi, so check a check first. Um, this one is PRG2475, and it was just released today. It's spectacular. Okay, this is another fabric that I already showed you today. I was telling you that it was kind of like it was painted, but it was more like etching. Um, this one here was also just released today, and it is a Wabi Sabi poncho. And this one is, do do. and in fact, if you type in this number in the search bar, um, you'll get to see everything that's in this fabric. So this one is PRC2528. This one I showed you a caftan in this fabric. I think I actually prefer it in the smaller poncho because um, it's just like a little hit of color and then you would wear it with something all solid at the bottom. It's pretty, pretty and it's a nice silk. Um, so this one is PR. C, G, P, R, G, 2499. Okay, this one, I showed you the, the blue caftan. Um, I would say, and I did say that, you know, the caftan is a smidge itchy, but I don't think that would be an issue with this because it's a poncho, you're gonna have to wear something under it anyways. And it's not gonna sit as close to your skin. So this one, she's gonna go fast because that's freaking gorgeous. See? And it's got little silver flecks running through it. So it's just a true ultramarine blue with silver flecks. It is the ultimate match everything, fit it into your wardrobe, feel like a million bucks piece. Um, highly recommend this one. And again, to get something that's this color and all one color is so rare. So this one has, um, it has some discoloration, but you probably have to really look to see it. Uh, we would have put it onto our video though. Um, so this one is PRC2541 and it's 40% off. And it was just released today and it's really pretty. Okay, here's another purple one that I already showed you. I think I showed you a midi length caftan in this and this is the poncho in the same fabric. So there we go there. Love how these lines would be diagonal if you wore it this way. I think they would end up being diagonal even if you wore it caftan length. Um, grays, different shades of purple and black. Just a real winner, this one. Um, and 40% off. It is PR... Oh, interesting. Okay, hold on. Glasses time. This one is... PRG2504. Great piece. Oh, and actually, if you pull in that number, you're going to see that we also have a vest that's Wabi Sabi in the same fabric. So I'll put that like that. Oh, fun fact, we have two vests and they're different. So there's gonna be a version A and a version B. 
So there are four pieces in this fabric, one full price and three that are not full price that were just added. And then I showed you this fabric before. It was the one with the kind of army green and gray. I think at least I did. Um, and then this one is PRG 2387 here. And then I know I showed you this one. This is the one that you were looking at, Sheena. Um, the other piece was a kimono sleeve top. This one is the poncho. So a little bit more flexibility on how you can wear it. But um, if you want something that's not gonna spin around and you know you're gonna wear it as a top, then the poncho is a good bet right there. So this one here is PRG2464. All right, so that's it for fabrics you've seen before. So, We'll start with blues again, because I know you guys all like your blues. And then maybe we'll go from blues to reds. So these are all the blues that just came in and are now part of the Wabi Sabi collection. Look at that one, so soft. A lot of blues. It's because I've been working with that uh, lady in India who understands when I say people like blue, she's like, I'll get you blue. So many beautiful blues, so many beautiful blues. Okay, this is not blue, but I have to show it to you. Every time I look at it, it takes my breath away. So we're gonna just pause from gathering blues to show you this insanely beautiful piece. So you can wear it this way. It's a poncho, so you can pretty much wear it any old way you want. Um, but look at that right there. You wouldn't have thought it. You wouldn't have thought gray and red with all of these yellows and persimony pinks. Um, but I feel like that right there is what makes this piece. And you could wear it asymmetrically so that that part is right there at the front. Or you could wear it as a tunic, like this is gorgeous. Just gorgeous. This one is PRG2492. Put that here. Finish gathering my blues. Okay, this is blue and green, but it's got some really cute blue in it. So we're going to show you that one. Um, ooh, here's another blue, also lovely. And here's another blue. Okay, so I think that's it for blues in ponchos. Nope, missed this one. Okay, so these have all just been added. The reason I missed it is because this side doesn't look so blue, but there's the blue right there. So really soft silk, you can wear it that side to the front, it's got this really fun embroidery on it. Right there, you can see that. Um, so again, this was just added to the Wabi Sabi collection. This one is PRC2546. And because it's a poncho, you can spin it around, wear it lots of different ways. Here's another one, again, super soft silk. This one is another, you can hear it. This is what butter sounds like. Hear it? <laughs> um, so yeah, great colors, super soft, um, grays, blues, kind of like a, a maroon wine color. It's got a little bit of white in there. Beautiful. Uh, this one is PRC2564. This is an, oh, I love this. If you have watery blue eyes, this would be insane on you because it's just that really pale watery blue. Um, and then it's got the black, so it doesn't look too sweet. It looks like it's got some character to it. It's just gorgeous. Um, this one is PRG, because it's Georgette, um, 2375. Okay, this one here. So I love this, and the reason I love it I mean, this is all nice. It's cool. It's greens and blues and like that's kind of funky, really artsy looking. But the reason I love it is because of that one line of like a deep red down at the bottom. I think that is just kick ass. Like uh, with, without that, it's nice. But with that, it's insane. And then you could just pull that color out in your accessories. Um, you can wear it with jeans. You can wear it with white linen, you can wear it with black. This is a great fabric. Um, PRG2456. 
So again, these are the Wabi Sabi pieces, so do check the videos because they all have some sort of a flaw. This one's really fun too. It's, um, it's dark green and teal. Yeah, perfect, you can see it right there. Probably you can see it more clearly there than you can see it in real life. In real life, the colors blend a lot. Um, but Poncho, Wabi Sabi, um, PRG2485. This one has a ton of embroidery. So here you can see it here, right there. And that's all done with silk thread. So none of this is gonna be itchy. It's just when you get to the gold threads that sometimes the embroidery can be itchy, but this won't be. So you've got a crepe silk, you've got all of that embroidery there on one side. If you were, now that this is on the hanger tunic length, but if you were to spin it around like this, so you were to wear it caftan length, or sorry, um, kimono sleeve top length, it would be like this with this really cool V in the front. It's extraordinary. Look at the border down there. It's, it's really something else. Um, this one is PRC2547, and it's 40% off because it's part of the Wabi Sabi collection. Here's another blue. This one is definitely a blue, leaning uh, towards gray. There's no teal in this. There's no yellow in it, it's just bluey grays. I think this would probably suit anybody. Yeah, I think it would suit anybody. Oh, and look at that. What a fun patch that's, no, it's not even a patch, that's embroidered. Is it a patch? I think it's a patch. That's really cool. That's really cool, nice patch. Um, so this one is PRG, two, four, seven, six. This one here is, again, we have teals, blues, and then grayed uh, Tiffany blue on this one. And this one, again, is part of the Wabi Sabi collection. It's sheer, and it's PRG2515. This one here, oh, this, this one feels like a million bucks. Um, it is so unbelievably soft. And then have a look at that pattern there. So it's kind of like muted sagey greens with different shades of blue and periwinkle. And again, it's a poncho. This one is PRG, C, C, PRC, 2525. This one. So when I was entering this one online, I just could not stop looking at the pattern because it's gorgeous. And then what's kind of fun about it is every once in a while, one of these has a little sparkle in it. Um, but the silk is like butter and the colors are really soft and sweet and I love the diagonal striping on this. So this one is PRC2555. And then we just have two more. This one's lots of different shades of magenta and I thought I saw some brown in there. I don't think so though. Magenta, blue, white, and black. And this one is a sheer one and it's PR. G, PRG 2487, and then this friend here, oh, gorgeous, so soft and beautiful. Um, it's different, it's kind of like multi-tonal blue. You can see it's got like, like stripes almost in it, almost like paintbrush stripes there. And then on this side, you have that. And this one is, do, do. This one is a faux silk, that's what I thought. As I, was, as I was feeling it, I'm like, hmm. So again, it is not polyester, it's made out of rayon, it is breathable, it's soft, um, it doesn't burn, so you don't have to worry about it melting, but it is not silk, and that's why it's part of our Wabi Sabi collection. It snuck through. This one is PRC2563. So that's all the blues, and now I'm gonna show you the pinks and purples. No, I'm gonna show you the reds. So, I guess that's red, that's red, and that's red. Then I'm gonna show you the pinks. So this one, I feel like, yes, you are gonna be seeing a vest in the same fabric. It's, a, the background is a pale pink, and then the, it's kind of like little 
feathers, like down feathers or tiny little petals, probably petals, um, in red. So pink and red, really sweet. Um, this one is also a poncho and this one is PRG2469. So cute. Um, and then this one here, oh, okay, you know what's really nice about this one? This one's cute, right? Until you flip it around. And then, let me see what it says here. Just gotta make sure I get this right. Okay, so this one is a crepe silk. And look at that embroidery. All of these designs here on this side are embroidered. They're like blades of grass. I'd say that's what they look like. You can see the embroidery there. It's just exceptional. Beautiful. This might be a nice festive piece to wear too because it's, it's earth tones, but there are reds and greens in there. Um, lots of beautiful embroidery. And this one is PRC2420. Okay. So I'm gonna show you guys the rest of these ponchos. What time is it? How long have I been doing this? So it's been an hour now. So I can hold off and show you the vests on another day because you know, I know you guys don't have forever. So maybe I'll just finish showing you the ponchos today and then we'll save the vests. So this one here is another poncho, beautiful earth tones. Um, and again, if you want to quick, if you want to quickly see the pieces that I'm telling you about, go to the search bar and type in DEC 10 as December 10, DEC 10. And just these pieces I'm showing you are going to pop up. Look at that one. Love that one. That one's so cool. And then this one here. Another great red and black. Now this one looks longer, right? But it's not. It's just that that's how it looks when it's tunic length. And that's how it looks when it's on the hanger, like asymmetrically. So they're all the same shape. It just depends how you spin them. This one with black in it and different shades of red, I know black goes really well, is PRC2526. And here's another one with black in it. I love those swirls. Ooh, that's fun too. Beautiful piece. Um, actually really nice. I could totally see wearing that anywhere. Um, PRG2517. Okay, I'm going to show you the pinks and the purples. And I'll show you the earth tones and then I think we're going to wrap it up. That's pink. Okay, so oh that's purple. All right, so these are pinks and purples, and then all that's left is kind of neutrals and, oh, shoot. Missed a blue, everybody. There was a blue. It was hiding. Look at that. That's freaking gorgeous, everybody. Freaking gorgeous. Look at those colors. That is such, like, I could see that with a pair of black linen pants. Um, if you took, wore this on vacation, like, what couldn't you wear it with? Black, white, and jeans. Like, that's everything you need, right? What a great piece. Okay, it was hiding. This one is a PRG uh, 2396. Put it with the blues. Okay, so this one here, I think, feel like I showed you something in this last time too. And I was saying how it's kind of like Scooby-Doo colors because it's so 1970s. I probably showed you the kimono sleeve top in it. So this is the poncho in the same fabric. And see how it's got that silver that's woven in down there, but it is not itchy at all, guys. This one is not itchy. I love that silver. That's so, that's what makes it like fresh because you've got these really earthy kind of 1970s tones, but then you got that pop of silver, which is so cool. This one is PRG2489. And when you pop that number in there, I think you'll see the other pieces that are also Wabi Sabi in the same fabric. Okay, this one's really nice. Oh my goodness. So when I was putting this one in, this one made me stop and give it a second look. So have a look at those colors, I hope. Yeah, there, you can see them there. So soft blue, dusty rose, black, white, kind of like a goldy color, pastels, um, but paired with black. So you get these really rich pastels that are slightly grayed out, mixed in with black. I think this is just, this one's a showstopper. It's so simple, but it's so elegant. I love it, especially love this section right here with the pink and the black. Um, this one is PRG uh, 2506. 
Mm, look at this. Incredible, right? So this is the digital print. Um, this one, this side has like ribbons or maybe water color kind of drippings, I guess, like paint drips. And then on this side, you have the flowers. It's stunning, just stunning. What a great piece. And I love how it ombres from the greens and yellows into the pinks there, and then back into the yellowy greens there, and then into purple. Really, really special, this one. It's PRG2494. And then, oh, look at that. This color is amazing. I want to say that this is that persimmon color as well. Um, persimmon and kind of like a cardboardy brown. Uh, love the paisleys, love the black. Gorgeous. Just like a little piece of watercolor art. Um, this one is PRG2514. This is fun, right? This one is, this has to be from the 90s. It's so fun. Um, I feel like we had a maxi dress in this at one point. Um, they're also amazing. Yeah, they really are. Um, uh, yeah, one after another, they're all amazing. Um, this one is called PRC2532. Really fun, very fresh. <laughs> it screams, I'm going to Hawaii, or not, but I wish I were. This, okay, the silk on this one, insanely soft. Um, it's a crepe silk. It's a little bit of a thicker crepe silk, but I wouldn't say like it's thick and stiff. It, ooh, that didn't sound good. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, it's very soft and flowy, but there is some density to the silk. Um, okay. It's PRC2534. I think I've been teaching high school too long because as soon as I say things like that, I wait for the room to erupt and go insane. And I've just been like programmed to look out for things, saying things like that. I think I may have told you this before. I, I was asking my students to do something and I kept getting like, just a sec, just a sec. And I stood up in front of the class just as the principal was walking past the door and I yelled, no more sex. And everybody went bananas. The principal popped their head in, like what the heck is going on there? Um, so yeah, that's all my teaching coming out right there. Um, okay, this one, so much fun, right there. Um, I actually, like I know it's bold, but I kind of like it. I think this is a 1970s print as well. You've got the avocado, you've got the orange, got a little bit of purple there for fun. The silk is unbelievably soft. Um, I like how this orange kind of becomes a little bit brown right through there. Um, so this one is PRC2557. Ooh, I love this too. Wow. Love those colors. Can you guys see how rich that is? It's just so muted. And those three colors together right there are spectacular. And then I love how it goes out to this. But just when you think, that's all. <laughs> Thank you, Sheena and Heather, for your... Oh, all of you. I know. Can you imagine yelling no more sex? Like, a, a, it was a good day. It was a good day that day. Um, there. Look at that embroidery. Now, these are actually... Let me double check before I say it. Yes. So this is not Mukesh work. Mukesh work is when the thread goes all the way through. Um, this is, these are embroidered on, you can see the threads there at the back. So each one of these beads is embroidered on and then there's embroidery as well. So in addition to being really great colors, it's got that little patch of embroidered flowers there that is to die for. So, um, this one's a winner. Whoever gets this, it's, it's a showstopper. It's definitely something, it's a conversation piece. You'll find yourself waving this arm around in front of people be fun and the silk is really soft um, this one is PRC 2437 and then this one it's really sweet it's sheer and this is kind of like a buff color in here like maybe a very pale camel um, and then the rest is pink and then it looks like it's white but it's not white it's a really pale pink I had those days in the classroom right it's it's funny it's funny what happens in a classroom and what people, when they just get a snippet of what's going on. Yeah. 
Yep. But you know, I bet you that I still have students who tell that story because they laughed so hard. And that's a good memory. Um, okay, PRG2478. Really pretty pink. And okay, because I'm not gonna show you the vests, I'm just gonna show you these last four because I've used up my hour. Love this one, guys. Love it. It is a crepe silk. It is a buttery soft. The pattern is so kind of fresh looking. Um, colors are coming out accurately there. I think it's just really pretty. Just such a pretty, pretty color. So I want to say that it, it's, it looks maybe a bit yellow, but it's not. It's camel. It is a camel color or a tan. It's not yellow. Um, I should tell you the number on that one. Really, this one's sweet. I could see this paired with gray. Um, it would be spectacular paired, paired with charcoal. Hi, Nancy. Um, this one is, doo -doo. yes, good memory. That's right. They'll remember it for the rest of their lives. Um, PRC2424. Okay, then this one here, oh, love. This is another one that I was waiting to see in person because when I created it, I thought it was really cool. Um, so let me, let me tell you a little bit about this one. So the border at this end and at this end. So, okay, we need to back up a step. When this was a sari, it would have gone on like this or the other way. It doesn't really matter. Oh, I guess it would matter, but I can't tell from here which it would have been, but it would have sat like this on. Um, so this would have been the top and this would have been the bottom. And both of those edges, uh, the rest is crepe silk. I mean, sorry, Georgette silk, you can see through it. But this little part right here, it's about two inches and two inches there is actually a satin. And the satin has, um, there you can see that it's got work done into a jacquard, I think that's called, when the actual, the actual weaving of the fabric has a print in it. Um, so that's there. You have like a floral print in the satin on that edge and on that edge. And then in between, you've got this really cool kind of stylized Greek key pattern. But I thought this one is spectacular. And you can see how it's a little bit shinier. You can see it right there. It's a little bit shinier because it's satin. So even though it's not like embellished or embroidered, it's got that little bit of detail right there that just amps it up a tiny bit. Um, this one's really special. I'd love to see the other pieces that are in the same fabric. So this one is PRG2404. And if you type that into the search bar, um, anything else we have in that fabric that's been released so far will show up. But I don't recognize this fabric from anything. I don't remember seeing it yet. It's really nice. Okay, then there's this one. And this is a color you don't see very often either. It's a dark avocado. There. And it's really soft and quite beautiful. Like I, what color green is that? Is it avocado? It is, it's avocado. It really is an avocado green. Um, but it's a darker avocado. Like it's, it's moving closer to um, like a moss green. I don't know. It's gorgeous though. It is absolutely gorgeous. And the silk is unbelievably soft, um, but very different color. Not something you see all over the place. And re yeah, really special. Um, like a leaf green, a dark leaf green. PRC 2418. If you don't see this one online, let me know because it doesn't have a sticker, which means it may not have been created and it doesn't look familiar to me. So let me know if you're interested in that one and you don't find it. Uh, this one, green, gorgeous. Um, avocado green is a great neutral. Yeah, it really is. It really, like, and it's a very, it's such, like, it doesn't feel green. It does. It feels like a neutral. Like you said, it feels like, like just a really solid earth tone. It's a great color. I'm going to have to look that one up. Um, actually, if anyone is there by their computer, PRC 2418. If that one doesn't pop up, let me know, because that means I have to release that one still. Okay, so this one is a brighter green, um, more of a emerald, and it's got some purple and some blue in there. 
Um, and this one is PRC2542. And then the last one I'm going to show you today is this. She's really pretty too. Look at those little circles. It's really cute. Just a cute little fun popover type piece. Um, and it looks like the, oh, that's neat. So this one has a brand tag, but the brand tag's been sewn on. That's the first time I've seen that. I kind of like it. That's fun. I wonder what it says. Not a clue, um, but that's it. So that's all I'm gonna show you today. Even, oh, did I drop one? No, I didn't. Uh, this one is PRG2468. And in case you were waiting for the vests, I will quickly take my camera and show you what vests were just released into the Wabi Sabi collection. Um, just in case you were like, but I was here for the vests. So let me just show you uh, real quick because I, I can't take up any more of your time. But all of these, this one is a really soft Georgette. Um, this one, again, a very soft Georgette. Um, short and sweet. It's been an hour. It's been an hour and 10 minutes. I just could go on forever, apparently. Apparently. Um, look at that one there. So that's another vest that was just released. Oh, that one's got this great border on it. And then it's got a leaf print. Oh, this one. We've got to have, we have a couple of pieces in this fabric and it's insane. Like just insane fabric. Um, so yeah, that one was just released. Ooh, this is pretty. Oh, can you guys, yeah, you can. See how it's kind of got a shimmer to it? So there's a tiny, tiny, tiny bit of silver thread mixed in, but not enough that it adds any weight to it or any texture. It just has a bit of a shimmer. You can see it there. Wow, that's nice. So again, if you, oh, wow. Okay, so I am kind of showing you these. Holy cow. So that's, we, I showed you another piece out of that same, sorry earlier. Wow. Is that ever nice? Okay, I do have to try that one on. Um, okay. Just because I am such a sucker for a digital <laughs> Oh, wow. It says, oh, did I end it? I don't think so. Um, okay, so I'm just going to try this on is so pretty. Okay, I feel like a summer princess, everyone. Like, I feel like I'm in bloom. I'm in bloom right now. Pause, but now you're back. Thanks for letting me know. Yeah, I think, dude, I think we must have all gotten that Amber Alert, right? Oh, maybe only people in Ontario got it. That would make sense. Yeah, this one's so sweet. Um, so I think I already told you the number of this one. PRG2494. This just added to the Wabi Sabi collection. And then I'm going to run you through the rest. So pretty. Wow. Okay, this goes this way. And then, yeah, see, I just said so pretty too, right? So funny. Look at us. Okay. So I think I already showed you something in this incredible silk fabric, which maybe faux silk, I think I told you. Ooh, look at that. Nice little border there. I think I showed you one in this fabric already. Don't know if I showed you one in that fabric, but that is a really cool fabric. Oh yeah, I did, right? Because remember I said it was kind of, oh no, that was a different one. I definitely showed you something in this fabric already. So this is the vest. It's part of the Wabi Sabi collection. Oh, guys, we were all fighting over this last week. There is another one. So I'm going to have to show you this one because there was um, a couple of caftans in this and everybody wanted it. Um, and now we have the vest. So this is part of the Wabi Sabi collection. It is the softest silk in the world. It is PRC 22, whoops, PRC 2447. Um, yeah. So that goes like, oh, it's just fun to do this, isn't it? Hear that? Yeah, love it. That's really sweet. And I would put this on. Just like that. 
have some fun. Okay, I may not ever take this off, um, but let me show you the rest of them. So here's another one with that same embroidery. I think I showed you a poncho in the same fabric, and there is a vest in the same fabric. And I showed you, I think, a poncho. Nope, yep, a poncho in that. And then, oh, look at the embroidery on that one. I feel like I've shown you something in this too last week or the week before. This one, I think I was saying that this would make a really good festive piece because it's such a great red. Um, and I think, if I'm not mistaken, yes, it is faux silk. I thought so. It's really soft though. Now, don't know if we've seen this fabric before. That's kind of neat. Um, or this one. This has a nice texture to it. Oh, we've definitely not seen that one before. Okay, I'm going to have to show you that one because this is another great one. Um, so this is blues, blacks, and whites and grays. Really very, very subtle, understated. Love the lines on it. I'm going to have to take this one off, guys. Silk on this is so nice. So let's see how the lines fall on this. So if I were to wear it as a top, oh wow. So the lines go like that. I think it's red neck this time again. Um, yeah. Wow. That's spectacular. Um, so it is a crepe silk and the colors would work with everything and you're going to get those long elongating lines if you wear it as a top and if you wear it as a vest i think you still get elongating lines if i'm not mistaken yeah you do it's a great one guys don't expect this one to last long either that's really something prc 2048. That's a nice one. Okay, I only have just a few more to show you. I'm going to grab the camera again. Lovely, rich pink. Some fun little sparkles. Oh, and that is embroidery. All of that at the bottom. Wow. That's silk embroidery. And it's, if I'm not mistaken, it's Mukesh work, which means they just put the thread through, then tied knots, and then put the needle back through to the other side. So those are all just knots um, in silk. Ooh, really rich, deep green, like a forest green. Ooh, that's fun. Look at that little patch there of all the little sparkles. And then there's another one there. Um, really great neutral colors. This one, I know I've shown you this fabric before. I still love it. Ooh, this one is a faux silk, 100% sure of that. Um, really soft though, great color. There's another digital print. There. So I'm showing you vests right now that were just added to the Wabi Sabi collection. So this, I think I showed you something else in this fabric that was full price. Oh, this one. So I know online, every time we try to take a picture of this, it's a different color. It is a... Salmon. I'm going to call it a pinky salmon. Um, it's not orange and it's not pink. Ooh, there's some purple and green. Ooh, it's some red and black. That's fun. Oh, this one. So we had this in, I can't remember, but everybody wanted it. And maybe it was a poncho and it went really quickly because of all of this embroidery. Uh, so now we have a vest from the same piece, beautiful soft silk. Um, insane embroidery on that one. Um, what's this one? Oh, this one's all just neutrally creams and browns. There's another purple I already showed it to you. We're done. We did it. We got through all of them. It only took us an hour and 20 minutes. Could have been so much worse. Hi, Holly. Um, so 
that's it. That's what we added today. A whole lot of full price pieces that we were just waiting on. Yeah, you're late, but that's okay because I'm going to share this and it'll be on the website too because I know, Holly, you were saying that sometimes you have trouble watching it on Instagram and getting any clarity. So um, as soon as I can download it, get it up onto YouTube, I will pop it up onto our website. Um, and I believe it's under Upcycled Silk and then it says what's in store. So you'll find it there. But yeah, here I'm showing you everything, but actually all I'm showing you is me. So I'm going to flip that around. Um, yeah, that was so much fun, Sheena. So these are all the pieces I just showed you. These were all added to the website. More than half of them are Wabi Sabi pieces. And um, I think that they will go really quickly. This is what the store looks like. The girls have been so good about keeping it looking spectacular. They're just unbelievable, all my girls. That's what it looks like. So there you go, everybody. Have a fabulous evening. I will get this up onto all the various channels as soon as I can. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask me because I do love to answer questions and and uh, talk to you guys because otherwise I would just be talking to a phone. But now I know I'm talking to you, so that's great. Um, take care, everybody. Have a great weekend. Enjoy yourselves. Bye.